did you know that according to the latest research, you, you can do it? So we're going. We are going to explore. It's our first time out together. It's so exciting. Just a new town. Hua Hin. We're in Hua Hin. So let's go see. I need some stuff. I got the bare basics. And I need mason jars for my rice broth. And I need a fan. Why they don't got a fan? So this is going to be our first preliminary exploration of Hua Hin. And we'll save the nature and oceans and mountains for another video. But here's our first impression. Let's do it. You know what I just noticed? They chemtrail the sky here. That's crazy. I thought Thailand was chemtrail free. Chiang Mai is chemtrail free. I never saw one, but here... Oh god. I guess it's a trade-off. The air was too nice here with the ocean breeze. We had to chemtrail it up. You piece of shit. They discouraged the early morning drunks here. So that's a good sign. You can't be drunk before 11 a.m. here in Hua Hin. I could have had a juice bar right by my house. But now I no longer cleanse my filthy body. I just gather it all. It's gonna happen. If you don't kill me, I won't kill you. There's nothing family friendly about that, Mark. That's all I know. I went in there, everything's 10 times the cost. Is that what you do to your family? You charge them out the yin yang. Apparently this is like a super cool night market and there's music and stuff. We'll go there one night. I wonder what is down here actually. Let's explore. Let's explore. We can go off route. Oh no, the wind. So we're just going down an alley. That was safe. What is this? House massage. And another massage. There's so many massage places here, it's ridiculous. Like three here. There's like 15 in front of my building. I probably saw 30 on the way here. It's like, <laughs> they really like to massage each other here. It's very friendly. This is a very steep hill. <laughs> oh, I'm not allowed here. <laughs> Where's the ocean? I wanna go to the ocean. Where are you going? Ocean. Can I go to the ocean? No? I'll leave. <laughs> Alright, that's a dead end. I'm still looking for access to that ocean. I don't know where. It seems like all these places are condos and resorts. And they lead to the ocean if you live there. But what's in there? Why they sneaking? Uh, it's nothing. Use coupon only. Oh, poor little doggy. Oh my god. Oh no. I went to that 7-Eleven to get water. It's probably like two kilometers from my house. And then as I'm riding back, if I had just went in the other direction, it was like 20 meters there was a 7-Eleven. I went to the wrong ass one. This is where life gets tricky here in Kwa Hin. Because it's... If you want to go that way, things get very awkward, but you can't, and then you have to go this way, and I don't know where I'm going now. I don't know how to get over that wall. Oh, help us. I realize that I have to go back down, do that loop-de-loop -loop shit again, go back to where we just were, and then I think I can circle onto this highway. My way. Instead of going down there, I'm cutting across. Life hack confirmed. What is all this? Eat happiness. Huh. Is that the go vegan of Thailand? Surrounded so hard right now by mountains. Look at all the mountains. You got a big ass lake here too. It's probably not a lake. It's probably a sewer system. 
All right, we found a Tesco. I don't know if this is like a Walmart type of thing or just a grocery store. It looks like they got all kinds of stuff. We need a bathing suit for that ocean and that new water park we just discovered. Hello. How you're doing it? There's those water slides closer up. We will definitely make a day of that. And the mountain off in the distance. And the chemtrails on top. Icing on the cake. I was gonna park my bike here, but there's so much poo on the wall and the ground, and then I look up, and it's like, there's a lot of birds up here. This is not a good spot. Hey, I'm on TV. Okay, so this is the small little Walmart type store. Free range duck eggs for 19 baht for four. Not that I would ever eat something like that. Of course. Hey, 25 to 75% off for stuff that sucks. That's a good deal. That's what drives me crazy about the Thailand eggs. It's like all these checklists of stuff, but it's like, what? This is 100% fed crack. Uh, we don't know what any of it means. Translate it for me. I've noticed a trend in Thailand. There's always whiteies modeling their clothes. It's like they think we're good looking or something. And they, it helps sales. Snake Diet guy has some competition on his hands. Uh oh. <laughs> they really take their toilet paper serious here. Clean wave, see, feel, charcoal fresh. Like, what did they add? Just let me wipe my bum and leave. They have an entire swimming suit store and it's all women's. Not that I couldn't pull it off. I'll stop. There's a horse. Oh. Is that what now? You have no idea what I'm looking at right now. It's the most glorious thing I think I've ever seen. Oh my god. Okay, I'll let you see it. Oh wow, looks like white sand beach. I've never been on a white sand beach. Does this even... Okay, it is stairs. Oh my god. Oh, there's horses on the beach. Wow. Oh, what a kick-ass beach. And the undertow doesn't look like it's crazy. And there's people actually swimming. There's a mountain over there. The glorious ocean. Ah, oh, just the air. Ah. Awesome. All right, I'm gonna go eat. All right, we're fueled up. We're ready to go hit the road again. And I wanted to just have some soda water before I leave. I'm just, I love this stuff so much. When you only eat certain foods and only drink water, and you can have something that bubbles on your tongue, like a bubble bath in my mouth, are you kidding me right now? Amazing. But I'm stupid. I bought this and I was like, yeah, I don't have a can opener, bottle opener. How am I going to do it? I devised a way. First I googled it and some asshole was like, you just, you grip it hard like this and you use your finger to pry it. And I'm like, and so I did that and I was like, Bark. yep, that hurts. And some other guy was like, he had something that he was doing and I read the comments and it's like, I'm bleeding. Yeah, me too. I bled. It's like, yeah. I've, I've done that. My last bottle opener didn't work, so I've devised a solution. You need something that height, and then you just... This, I keep banging this finger into that. I don't know if you can even see it. Let me actually readjust this, just in case. It worked so much better last time. And then that goes flying somewhere. And then you have yourself some soda water. Phenomenal. So I'll drink this, and then if I can 
find a bathing suit tonight, we will dip ourselves in that ocean. I will be in the ocean. In the ocean. I got all dressed up and then I heard something outside. I was like, is that rain? Is it raining? Oh. And yeah, it was raining. But in the tropics, even the rainy season, whenever it rains, you gotta know it's pretty much just for one hour. So I thought I was gonna come see the sunset. I think we missed it. So what I wanna do is just explore a little bit of the opposite side. I'm going, I don't even know what direction this is, but I want to see what's the closest route to the beach. And Aloy Mac 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 Mac. We're in the ghetto now, son. <laughs> Why does this street just seem like what happened? I was on a happy, busy main road where people were dancing and cheering. Now there's a rabid dog. What's this guy doing? <laughs> He almost killed us both. This dog up here. Don't look at it. Don't make eye contact. Oh no. Yeah, like this can't be good. How could this be good? So what do you crap? It's so funny. It's like if I saw this place in Toronto, I would turn back. I would go back that way. But Thailand is different. Even the gangsters are like, how can we help you? <laughs> so I think we're getting close. Look at all this magic. It's like ghetto and then magic land. Holy cow. I tell ya, I think we made a good choice coming to Hua Hin. What's down here? Like, what is this? What did this turn into? Is that a mountain? Is that a freaking mountain? It's so dark. Sorry if you can't see anything. Am I being followed by gang members? There's a big Buddha. Big golden Buddha on the mountain. I think we made it to a beach. That's pretty close to my house. Oh, there's wild dogs on the beach. That can't be good. Oh, we're at the ocean. We are at the ocean, my friend. That's where I am, if you're curious. Cow Techiab. And we'll go say hi to that big golden Buddha. And maybe climb the mountain? There's like a restaurant. Bunch of people there. It's not as private as I thought. We got the ocean here. There's actually stars. There's no way they're going to show up on camera, but... Wow. Hey, look at my shadow. There's a dog on my hand. Oh no. Oh no. I think we'll come here another day. In the light. So you can see everything. We'll just go check out this Buddha quick. Look at the beach front. Just going all the way around. There's wild dogs. They guard the Buddha. This one definitely has rabies. It's foaming at the mouth. That's not good. Wow. Oh my god. That's a lot of Buddha. Yeah, another day we'll go up you can probably go to the top of that thing and then see the city. So far so good on the city. It feels right. It just feels like this was the right move at this time. Who knows how long I'll be here but just for the first time I want to take deep breaths because the air is like fresh. I'm digging it. I'm digging the town. So lots to explore. Oh, oh I'm in the ocean. Are those jellyfish? Oh my god. What the hell is that? Is that a jellyfish? 
Is that a freaking jellyfish? I think that's a jellyfish. Oh my god. This beach is infested with jellyfish. Is that a jellyfish? What have I done? Where have I moved? I've moved to jellyfish land. Oh my god, a crab. Is that a fucking crab? Oh, what am I doing here? What am I doing? I'm going back to Toronto. This is terrifying. There's all these things. And I don't know what they are. Why am I so afraid? All my dreams, I'm running away from something. Why do things chase me and why do I run from them? I'm afraid to go out there now. Even in the daylight, I just saw two dead jellyfish. There's another one. They probably don't even show up on the camera. It might not be, it could just be a fucking mushroom for all- Oh my god, it's coming closer. Oh, that was aggressive. Wait, unnecessary. I gotta talk to some locals. They'll understand. They'll let me know the dangers of the sea. When I can go in, how deep. Be nice to go swimming. Actual swimming. And I think we're done here for today. Thank you so much for watching the video. Consider giving it a thumbs up, of course, if you liked it. Thumbs down if you gave Bigfoot a massage for 24 minutes instead of the half hour, but you charged him full price. What's biting me? All right, things are biting me. Just give him the whole thing. <laughs> the brightest light on Earth. The stars. I'll try to get some photos of the stars. I'm not much of an astrophotographer, but I'm sure I can pull it off somehow. All right, we're done. Thank you so much for watching the video. Subscribe for more of them videos. I messed it up. We'll see you in the next one.